everyone, get out of here. And today we're just going to be checking out a quick little thing in AOPG. And uh, why is that my normal intro now? Do I just want to just go in as a girl for, this, for these intros? What's wrong with me? But yeah, uh, we're going to be checking out the Snake Man update I just got dropped on AOPG. Because obviously I live on this game and I wanted to, you know, post it. But yeah, currently we are on the Wilderness Island where um, the S Luffy is. The Snake Man Luffy that is. So let's quickly go and show you actually how to get this thing. It is a 1% drop rate normally, but currently it has a times 2 EXP going on. Times 2 EXP. Uh, <laughs> it has a times 2 drop rate going on, so it's at 2%. But I saw that there was an announcement made where they increased the job chance. So it may be 4%, but I'm not sure. You can see fire is here. Because I told him earlier that I got Snake Man and he does not want me to one up him. So, yeah. Uh, this right here is where Luffy actually spawns in. And uh, yeah, you beat him. Here is some clips of me actually beating him. Okay, yes. Don't question my song of choice. That's just what I went with, all right? Like, I was like, I wanted some hype music to try and get some stuff. And, uh, yeah, I did get some hype music. So, and it actually did work because, yeah, well, you can probably see that I actually got it over there. And, uh, yeah, a funny moment happened, actually. I was actually talking to Moth, which, if you guys actually are on the, uh, the Twitch side, you know who that is. That's my girl right there. And then she was, um... I was like, hey, yeah, I kind of want to commission you for some stuff for my Twitch. And she was like, no, I, I, I'll I reject. I can reject people. And then she started laughing at me. And around the same time, I actually got Gear, gear 4 Snake Man. So, yeah, she was my lucky charm for that one. But, yeah, let's get on right into it, shall we? And I'll see you guys at Wano. Because if I remember correctly, I tried... um. I tried to do the showcase for it on Blackbeard Island, but I kept on one-shotting the enemies, so I had to go all the way to Wano. But yeah, see you in Wano. We are here at Wano. Nice lush area to test our damage on. And this is going to be without hockey, without any, um, any Super Saiyan, as you can see from my thing over there, or... What's another one? Or any accessories. This is going to be fruit, max fruit alone, which is currently 5,400. And yeah, let's get on right into it. First one up is Jet Culverian. And damage will be shown on screen. Yeah. You can see that's 630,000. I don't even need to, you know, look that far about it. Look at it. Bam. Super fast cooldown too. I think it's 5 seconds. Next one up is called Homing Culverian. Boop. 540,000 with an extra... What was it? 200 and something? Yep, 270,000. Let me just clear these guys out. Hey. Get out of here. Yep, there you go. That's that. Next one up is going to be Black Mamba. This is what Black Mamba does. And it basically uh, makes you stay in place. So, check it out. Damage will be shown on screen. Look what happens. I'm stuck for a couple of seconds from now. So, yeah. Don't use this move, like, regularly. And if people are following you, please don't use it. And finally, King Cobra. Check this one out. Damage will be shown on screen. Look at that, dude, look at that. That's without hockey, by the way. It just straight up just does burn damage to them, which I find so cool. Ow. You know what? Jet Culverian. That too. And take, have another uh, black, uh, King Cobra. What? What? Game, do you know how to aim? That went the totally opposite direction. Take care, people, and I'll see you in another video because there's another one coming up that has to do with the Saiyan race and Germa. But, yeah, take care. Bye-bye.